Nestled in the heart of downtown Columbia is Allen University, an intimate institution known for its excellence in higher learning. We're full of energy and enthusiasm. We have great students who are excited about being here, being a part of the Allen University family. Allen University was established in 1870, just seven years after the signing of the Emancipation Proclamation. The university's mission was to educate newly freed slaves and to train individuals to become clergy for the African Methodist Episcopal Church. Today, the university is known as the Liberal Arts College, offering eight academic majors and 17 concentrations. This building behind me here is Arnett Hall. I remember coming, this is where I stayed for three years. Uh, the science building over there used to be the tennis coach. You used to play football, cork ball, tennis out there. It's just a vast improvement. The school prides itself on STEM. It's a program funded in part by the Department of Energy that gets students involved in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Science is life. Science is what you can see. Science is real. Without science, you can't just do anything. Several students benefit from this program, including athletes who say hitting the books is their top priority. I like being a STEM major. We get a scholarship for it, and I was here during the summer, so I had like a jump start on school. Here at Allen, the small campus setting makes it easier for students to interact with instructors. Going to other schools like USC or any other school, it's, you, have, you have a lot of students in the classroom. Here in the classroom, here at Allen, some of the classrooms you have where the teachers are one-on-one -on -one with you, inside the classroom and outside the classroom. I teach who I am. And, and I believe that um, the energy that I bring into the classroom, like all of our faculty, comes from within. When it comes to academic competitions, you can count on Allen to be a part of it. We were fortunate enough to go to New Orleans uh, and participate in the Sigma Tau Delta International uh, Conference. And Allen had two students to participate, and one of those students won uh, in two places from the presentation. For more than 142 years, Allen University's presidents were male, but that officially changed on March 29, 2012, when Dr. Pamela Wilson was inaugurated as the university's first female president. I am committed to preserving and celebrating Allen University's history and protecting her legacy. I am dedicated to maintaining her presence, and I am committed to safeguarding and securing her future. Dr. Wilson was named president in February of 2011. Under Dr. Wilson's administration, the university established its own police force and restructured Allen's academic programs so that they reflect the community at large. We have new partnerships with various hospitals, for example, Palmetto Health Richland and Baptist, as well as Providence Hospital. The university has several civic, religious, and social organizations. You want a sense of family. And so it's kind of, in, in, in your mind, you can imagine being surrounded by a group of individuals who not only care about your academic needs, but your spiritual and your personal ones. Allen also has a strong Greek life presence, representing the National Panhellenic Council. Students here say when you come to Allen, despite the differences, you feel at home. But what about if you're from another continent? No need to worry, because Allen has got you covered. University teaches the heart to love, and so far I'm an international student from Nigeria, and I feel so much love that I feel at home. So Allen University has, has been really been great at that aspect. But what about the fighting yellow jackets? If I do this basketball program, I can do anything that I put my mind to. Allen is complete with the men's and women's basketball team as well as the women's volleyball team. The school is a member of the National Association of Intercollegiate Athletics. It's a small school, but yet at the same time, still gives you a good opportunity of being noticeable. Dr. Wilson says being a part of a vibrant university and one where students are achieving speaks volumes about the faculty and staff. We have faculty who are bringing to the table new ideas for innovative classroom teaching styles as well as curriculum development. Allen's model is we teach the mind to think, the hand to work, and the heart to love. Dr. Wilson says this captures the essence of what it means to be at Allen. As the school's newest leader, she strives to break the mold and show students anything is possible. There is no such thing as the glass ceiling when you're committed to excellence. 